starts to go
shit. That works pretty good. Yeah. Who says I don't give my tractor the bath, huh? <laughs> That's city water, baby. That looks pretty good. Alright. How different now? Yeah, I'm putting fertilizer on down here at Far Hills. Uh, yeah, I'm get away from this noise. I've got pretty much everything fertilized that you can see. Well, everything on this side of the driveway is fertilized. I uh, brought that tractor and sprayer up with the uh, with the Western Star because it was just easier to load it up on there and, and uh, you know drag it out here than it would be for me to uh, yeah than it would be for me to drive it because it would just a take the tires off the front and back and off the sprayer and why not just run the truck just a smarter way to go so anyway yeah here we are beautiful place it's going to green up pretty quickly if we get a little bit of rain which is something that I'm praying for right now uh, but until we get that I guess I'm just going to have to hope and uh, hope that we do get some I mean it's been three weeks actually just fold this up. I got a leak up there. So anyways, I'm going to have to doctor that up in a minute. Um, what I'm going to do is go actually uh, fill my sprayer tank up. I'll fill the sprayer tank back up. And then I will, uh, I can see in the camera there. I have a camera on the back of this thing just for the fun of it. I'll fill the sprayer back up, and I got two more pieces to go yet for tonight, and I can honestly say then I am done for the day. Uh, two small fields, I think one's about seven or eight acres, and the other one is just a little snip of about an acre, acre and a half. So I got about nine acres left, I think I got 400 gallons, so I should be good. I will be good, I won't need any more fertilizer on this particular farm. Unless I've forgotten a spot, which I don't believe I have. They parked hay wagons up on this one piece that I normally put fertilizer on, but I'm not even going to worry about that. But there it is. This is this is Far Hills Race Meeting Association. You know, and uh, I do the infield and the surrounding grounds, but you do not. And I repeat, you do not go on the track with anything. You get caught out on the track with a tractor or anything like that, your ass is grass, you are now uninvited to do anything here, and they never talk to you again. So, one of those things, when you get on the racetrack with a piece of equipment, you lose your life, according to the people that own the place. And I believe them. I don't think that you want to be messing with their livelihood, which is actually that nice green grass to the right. Why is this thing not focusing? Right? And of course, to the left. And it's not focusing. You know, I'm really, really, really displeased with this camera. 